Welcome back to my channel. My name is Heather. Um, I do have Freya with me, but right now she's on the floor and I don't really want to disturb her at the moment, but she's here. She's right beside me. So today I am going to do a um, unboxing of something that's called Wicked Good Cupcakes. I saw it on Facebook, I think it was, and I thought, oh, that looks interesting. So I thought I would go ahead and see what it was about. It is not a subscription box, meaning that you don't go out and subscribe to anything. It's not a monthly thing. This is more like if you have a special occasion or you want to send something to a friend or, you know, you know, whatever occasion there is, if, if there's a wedding, there's probably items out there that would be fit, fit for, you know, a bride and groom. Um, I know they do have a birthday one. They do have their new fall ones that just came out. They do have many different options. Um, and I'm going to give you an idea of what some of the options are. So they have, um, a two pack that would just be two of the cupcakes in a, a mason jar basically is what they are um they have the option of a four pack you can get a six pack sorry guys i'm really trying to not look down the entire time um they have an option of a 12 pack then they do have um they have a shop birthday shop by flavor you can shop cupcakes and wine and I will say, I do not have a link myself that's going to give you a discount, but whenever I went onto the website, they did have, if you sign up for their emails, that they would send you a 10% off. Um, so unfortunately, I do not have a personal link that's going to give you a discount, but they do have when you go on the website where you can get 10% off when you sign up for their emails. Um, and I believe whenever I saw this, they did have a promotion for 20% off. And so I was able to use that. And what I chose to get was I got two of the cupcakes and a bottle of wine. And they do give you a little bit of choice on the wine for example, they had where you could get um, a Moscato, which is what I opted for. I believe they also had where you could get a different type of white wine. I know they had a red wine. I want to say they had a rosé, but I'm not 100% sure on that, so don't hold me to it. Anyway, so let's get into it. And um, I should have said this in the beginning. I'm sorry. Welcome back to everyone that has been following me for a while that subscribed and welcome all the new comers that are here, you know, just to see what it's about. My name is Heather and what I like to do is do a bunch of different unboxings. My goal is to get to a point where I have enough subscribers where I can become monetized and raise awareness for a special needs kitten that I have at the moment. Um, she is not able to use her back legs, so she is having to use a wheelchair and some of her medical expenses can get a little costly. So I thought that if I could get enough subscribers to get to a point where I could be monetized and then start getting, um, you know, companies that want to work with me, that want to collaborate and everything like that, then, you know, maybe I can help with maybe that money can help with some of her medical costs. So that's my goal, just so you all know. Anyway, so back to what we were doing. So it's going to come in a box like this, okay? And as you can see, it says Wicked Good Cupcakes. And it does tell you to open immediately, all right? So remember, this is perishable. This is food. So you do need to uh, make sure that it's not just sitting in a closet somewhere for, you know, a week or so, because by then it's just not going to be good, right? Because it's perishable. All right. So I had already kind of opened it up to see if it told me that it needed to be refrigerated and it does not say that. So you can do a little card and it. So if you were giving this as a gift, the person would get a little card that looks like this. And then on the inside, it'll say who it's from. I think you can personalize that too, but I'm not 100% sure. All right, so then apparently they were on Shark Tank. So you can see that here. 
and it says each cupcake jar contains the equivalent of two regular size cupcakes. For the best cupcake experience, eat within seven days. So again, you don't want to forget this box and stick it in a closet. And then, you know, all of a sudden, two weeks later, you're like, oh, where are my, where's my cupcakes? And then you're like, oh no, probably shouldn't eat them now. Then it says, or freeze immediately for up to six months. Okay, so that's a good thing to keep in mind. Remember, food perishable. Okay, so when you open it up, it's going to look like this. It says, cheers to you. And then when you pull the flap back, I had it upside down this whole time. It's going to look like this. So I think what I love about this is the fact that they go ahead and they give you the spoons, right? How awesome is that? So if you were out somewhere and um, let's say you sent this to somebody's corporate office or something like that, and they wanted to go ahead and try it, like they could completely just dig in, right? Because there's two spoons here. All right, I am not going to taste these today because I'm saving them for when my bonus son comes over so that he can <laughs> try them because one of these I know is his favorite. He loves red velvet. So one of them is red velvet. And as you can see, I mean, you get like a good amount. It is filled to the top. It's not like a bag of chips where you open it up and three quarters of it is air and then you only have like a quarter of chips. This is filled to the top. So I'm already impressed with that, right? It's not filled, you know, part of the way or whatever. It is completely to the top. Like you can see that it, you know, it's probably just short of touching the lid here. <laughs> All right. And then the other one we have is chocolate ganache. And so I got this because I do have a couple of chocolate lovers in my house. So I thought that this would be something that they would enjoy. I don't remember if they do gluten free or not because I have a feeling that's the first question that a lot of you will ask. I do remember that they did say that they can't guarantee that, um, this is nut free just because of the way that it is done in the factories. Okay. Um, so just be aware of that. Make sure that you go on their website and that you double check. If you have nut allergies, you know, double check me because I think I remember reading that they cannot guarantee that it's nut free because of it being done in a factory. Okay. And then the other thing we got was some Moscato. I have never tried this brand before, so I'm interested to see how this tastes. So um, I'm actually looking forward to that. It says it's sweet and fizzy. It's a sparkling wine. It says Elo is finished for joy, which tells you everything you need to know about this sparkling wine. Okay, well, I'm hoping that Elo brings me joy. All right, because um, I'm pretty sure, even though I am on health plan, I have told you guys that before, but I am going to have a small taste of this one and a small taste of this one because I, even though I'm on a health plan, I'm not going to deprive myself of something that I feel is a little special. I mean, I look at the box, like who can't love the way this comes packaged? And remember, they give you the spoons, right? So, gotta love it. Anyway, so I will put the link for Wicked Good Cupcakes below so that you guys have it. And remember, um, it comes as a pop-up. So when you get on the website, just wait a few, you know, a few minutes. See if that pop-up comes up. Go ahead and sign up for their email because then that way you get 10% off. And um, I wanted to try this, so if I do have a special occasion for someone and let's say they live in another state or, you know, I may not see them for their actual birthday, then I can go ahead and order this ahead of time. I can schedule it to be there on or around their birthday and then they have a wonderful little surprise that they can go and enjoy and think of me while they're having it. All right, so prices on this particular one remember I said I got 20% off so the price that I'm going to give you is the actual price on their website it's not going to be with the 20% off 
So let me pull that up for you all right quick. All right, so this particular set was $59.99 and it comes with free ground shipping. And I remember when I looked on the site that the shipping was on particular days. So you'll need to go as far as being free. So for example, if I were to order this and I needed it like the next day sent to the person like and they needed to receive it the next day or the following day, it's like anywhere else. You're going to have to pay extra for that, right? Because they have to put it together, they have to package it, and basically you you know, did it at the last minute. Whereas if you go online and you know that you have at least three days before the receiver needs to get it, then you can get the free ground shipping. And that's what I did is I went online and I got the free ground shipping. The other thing I would say is that you probably would want, if you're going to do this and you want the free shipping, is that you're going to want to go onto their website about two weeks before you need it to get there. Because I remember I went on last week and I'm sorry, the week before I think it was and I was looking and in order for me to get the free shipping, I wouldn't be able to get it until um, having it delivered this past Friday. Um, so just keep that in mind. You know, this is a good website, I think, to bookmark. So whenever you have a special occasion that's coming up, you know, maybe set, your, set yourself a reminder for two weeks before that special occasion if you're wanting to do this particular box and then go out and set it up so that you can take advantage of the free shipping. Free shipping is always wonderful if you ask me. Anyway, so that is the overview of this box. I can't wait to try it. Um, and what I'll do is after we try it, I will do a update down in the comments so that you guys know how we liked them and everything. I'm really excited about both of those flavors. And like I said, they do have some fall flavors that just came out. So go out there and have a look. I think one of them, of course, was pumpkin. Um, so, you know, pumpkin anything for me during this time is always welcome. <laughs> anyway, so have a great day. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring the bell. Let's have a conversation, um, make some comments, hit the thumbs up if you liked my video, and I will see you guys later.